Thank you very much indeed, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> one, two. Testing, one, two. Thank you. Thank you very much indeed, ladies and gentlemen. Well, it's a great pleasure, of course, uh, to be here today as the best man at this glorious wedding here today. Of course, the wedding of Kathleen and Cecil. <laughs> and of course, we're all very grateful to be here today on this great occasion. And I'd like to thank you all um, for coming along today, indeed, at such short notice. <laughs> Now, there's been a lot of talk about the reason why the wedding, of course, was brought forward today. And, of course, the bride and groom weren't too pleased with some of the things that they've heard about I, I, people today saying things out in the top. Uh, and said, of course, want to test them. They said that, uh, I, uh, and someone said, People today said that the bride also. <laughs> testing one. And this is not true at all. No way is it true. It's just, just the way she was walking. And, but uh, we thank you all for being with us. We'll all miss the bride and groom when they leave the neighborhood, um, Kathleen and Cecil. And, um, Kathleen, of course, will be all, she'll be particularly missed when she leaves, of course, because she was always <laughs> a popular sort of a girl, really. <laughs> and um, <laughs> and um, um, I suppose an obliging sort of a girl, really. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, never, never let you down, really. The sky was the limit, really, I so We'll all... We'll all be sorry to see the back of our, but uh, that's what, so to speak. But, uh, but you're walking, I say. It's a great honour, of course, and honour is the reason we're here, really. <laughs> Think about it. <laughs> honour. <laughs> well, she offered her honour, <laughs> and he honoured her offer. <laughs> Can you welcome me, the father of the bride? Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'd like to welcome you all, you all to the wedding concert reception. Today, I am happy that my daughter is getting on me, getting married. I remember when she first, when she first came to me. And she said that she wanted to get married. I said, is it someone you know? It, it turned out to be someone we all know. So he came around to my house, you know what I mean? <laughs> and he says, uh, I'd like to marry your daughter. I said, uh, have you seen her mother? <laughs> and, uh, he says, I have, but I'd sooner marry your daughter. <laughs> Which she did. I'd like to thank, to thank everybody today who bought a gift. Everybody except for two <laughs> who didn't bother their mother. Bother. <laughs> who didn't bother to buy anything. Uh. Now. <laughs> <laughs> they are the two uh, that got no dinner here today. <laughs> and they weren't on our side of the family either. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Now, today, I would like to just remind you of the wedding gifts that have been received. There were 25 ironing boards, 17 lampshades, all useless. And uh, an electric toaster that only works, only works in America. <laughs> and some smarter Alec. Some comedian here bought them a pram. <laughs> a baby carriage. And had it delivered to the church. Marked urgent. <laughs> if I find out who he was, I'd like to help him to laugh it off in the intensive care unit <laughs> in the county hospital. Now, this wedding today is costing me a f fortune. And I would like to call upon the chef to come out and face us. <laughs> Today was the first time I saw roast beef glowing in the dark <laughs> and Brussels sprouts in their jackets. <laughs> I thought the chef made a ball to the cabbage. <laughs> Now, and, uh, well, that's a good match, I'll keep that. <laughs> I would like to single out the man now, my son-in-law. We're related now to drink. <laughs> my daughter, could, could have married a man with intelligence. <laughs> she could have married a man with money. With money. <laughs> Are you listening to me down there? She could have married a man who was working. <laughs> she could have married a man that wasn't working but was willing to work. <laughs> she could. She could have married a man. She could have married a man. Good luck. Hey.